makes me smile when you say that. Okay, I feel it now. Don't back up too much onto the road. Are we ready? Hey everybody, it's your friendly nosy neighbor, Jessica Carden and... Chad Murdoch. How's everybody doing? So we're here for another What's Next Idaho Falls. Yep, yeah, what's going on in Idaho Falls? This just came out in the paper a couple days ago and I've already had a number of people ask me about information on this. So we figured we'd we'd give you a little bit of info. It's a really big deal. This is a really cool announcement. So we are on 49th South. Yeah, in between St. Clair Road, 15th East and Hit Road. Yep. So we're right by the LDS Church and across from the Parkwood um, Parkwood Equestrian Center. Yep. Brookside subdivision is right here. Across the street from that is the dunes. Yep. Right and down of course, from the golf Sand course. Creek golf course. Yeah. yeah. So. so this is a great location and you may have seen this big giant field and we have some cool news. Yeah. So basically behind what they're buying is 50 acres, 50 acres and it's behind the church here and it goes out this way pretty much all the way to 15th East with the exception on the corner 10 acres, which is reserved for commercial. And behind the church here is going to be single family homes. So All this, this is subject north. to change, by the way. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. These are preliminary. Yeah, All yep. preliminary, yeah. But as of now, they're thinking um, single family homes, quarter acre to a third acre lots, probably two to three car garage, 1500 square foot. That's what Dustin Mortimer, Mortimer was telling me this morning. So kind of your middle of the road, kind of affordable house. Mm -hmm. Yeah, That's really great. nice home. Yeah. Yep. Yep. So we're not talking about the high-end homes that are half a million. These are going to be affordable home, like affordable middle of the road homes. Yeah. Yep. Excellent. Yep. And what's probably most exciting, something that I've been wanting to get here for many years, and that's a 55 plus community. There is, in my opinion, huge demand for that. Yeah. And uh, it's in a great location. Yeah. I mean, we're close to so many different things in the city of Idle Falls. So are there any other 55 plus communities in Idle Falls that you know of? I mean, I'm not aware of any that identifies themselves as 55 yeah. plus. And if they are, they're ones that were built a long time ago before the, kind of the standards for the 55 plus communities came out. I think so. I can only think of one that's not really a community. It's kind of like an apartment complex over by the temple. There's one that's there, but I can't think of anything else. So yeah. that's a big deal. Yeah, there's, a, yeah there, there's nothing like this. Yeah from what I've heard so far. And so. with a lot of right now, there's a lot of people that are moving downsizing mm -hmm. in that 55 plus community. Now, interestingly enough, the first community that's going to be opening um, in the Northgate, new Northgate subdivision in Pocatello is a 55 plus community. Yeah, I think we're gonna see a lot of these Huge. going on. It's a big deal. Yeah, these communities have, like uh, Dustin was saying, he thinks they're gonna have a clubhouse. Again, all this is preliminary, but probably a clubhouse. 55 plus communities typically have walking space um you know it's just a beautiful little area where people can it's a simpler life but and these not are usually no maintenance usually they like the hoa takes care of stuff exactly yeah yep yep so very cool yeah okay okay what's next you'll see okay here okay. we are location number two location number two and final destination we're at the paramount theater so they are not rebuilding a paramount but they did file for some new seating. Mm -hmm. And so it's gonna be a portion of the Paramount. We'll have some new seating from the information we received. That should be up, I don't know, they filed it. So. Coming soon, so yeah, it's out there. Yep. And this is, the, this is the Paramount, if you're not familiar with us, that's right across the mall, corner of 17th and Channing. Yep. So, by the way, great popcorn. Oh yeah, great popcorn, great company, great people. Yep. What's next? And if you like learning more about this kind of stuff, you should be following the Nosy Neighbors page yes. and the Murdoch Van Wearing Company um, page because that's how you're going to keep in the know. And our goal is every week we want to have some updates come out with new stuff that's going on. So if you see something, let us know. We'll research it. And every week we're going to try to be able to get you some new stuff yeah. that's going on. What some do new you want to know about? And we'll get nosy.